we've seen a number of studies, uh, preclinical and early clinical studies, that essentially suggested that the addition of uh, double inhibition of, uh, of uh, uh, HER2 uh, is superior to single inhibition in patients with metastatic colorectal cancer uh, that overexpress HER2. Now, uh, HER2 is a target that's rare on colorectal cancer. It's about 4% of the patients. Um, not so rare, but rare enough to make studies such as this one uh, difficult to conduct overall. Uh, we've had some hints from uh, two studies, Heracles, uh, which essentially uh, told us that adding lapatinib to trastuzumab uh, did seem to induce about 30% response rate in uh, uh, metastatic colorectal cancer that overexpresses HER2. Uh, we had another study with my pathway with uh, trastuzumab and then uh, pertuzumab that also showed a uh, 30 plus percent response rate. Uh, albeit, you know, there are some relative toxicities to lapatinib that are non HER2 targeted and with pertuzumab uh, and trastuzumab you can get significant toxicities. The thought is essentially to use this oral tyrosine kinase inhibitor called tocatinib, which is a very specific HER2 inhibitor. It's a much cleaner uh, HER2 uh, inhibitor than lapatinib, and also more potent and more on target, um, in addition to trastuzumab.